Welcome back everybody to a little MK Mobile and we are in the fatal, the fatal Adenian Tower and we are up against our first pretty formidable boss fight which is fight number 60 and just take a look at this badass rain. Now let's read through his passive real quick because this is just a crazy crazy passive. So we've got heavy weather is what it's called. Classic rain gains a 15% power generation increase till the end of the match per unique lasting negative effect applied by him or a teammate. Power generation effects stack up to seven times. Any negative effect applied to a soaked enemy by a classic teammate has a 75% chance to be applied as a team negative effect. Classic teammates start with one bar power. Absolutely crazy. And then joining him in this fight is none other than Fire God Liu Kang, who is looking pretty freaking badass as normal. Um, and Classic Raiden, guys, Boss Classic Raiden. So they've got some serious equipment going on just for fight number 60, um, but we're gonna get into it here. And everybody, I'm using the same team and same tactics I used for the Boss Fight 200 on the normal tower. And that is basically just freezing and stunning the opponent with Strike Force Scorpion. And that wasn't too bad of damage there. Then I drop in Nightmare Freddy Krueger and try to get his SP2 up to 100%, but obviously I failed in that one right there. But don't worry, because I'm gonna fail big time right here as well, as he's just over there whipping. Now, check this out. We're gonna see Rain's awesome reverse roundhouse. So I just love that throwback to uh, UMK3. And here comes Fire God Liu Kang. Gonna put some hurting on Freddy Krueger. Now, I do believe I get him out of here and bring in Scorpion here. Yes, so I do bring in Scorpion and just try to get him, uh, spam him a little bit with Scorpion's SP1 while my other teammates uh, generate power. That's kind of the, the way I set my talent tree up. Uh, it does seem like it's slower generating during boss fights for some reason, um, but here we go. We're back with Freddy, getting caught off guard just a little bit there with uh, Fire God Luke Kang's basics. And I come back and do hit him with some pretty good basics here, as well as a good combo in her that gets some pretty good critical damage and my goal is to get up right here to his sp2 now check this out i do get up to 91 percent on this one so it is going to do some hurting now check this damage out that is the magic of freddy right there it takes him out classic rain is back in coming up against another classic classic ermac you guys gotta love classic ermac he is just a badass as you know if you watch my videos big fan of classic ermac um big fan of just the classic and i love look at rain's classic rain stance there exactly like uh, UMK3 just going throwback to the classic. They did an excellent job with this character. You guys um, love it. But anyways, we are putting some hurt on him. Here we go. He's in the bubble. Gotta love that. Reverse roundhouse. And I think I get him out of there. Yeah, so here we go. We're gonna go do a little damage with uh, Strike Force. I'm gonna S spam that SP1. And I feel like at this point I'm not doing too bad, but then I realize it is only fight 60. <laughs> so I'm thinking like, you know, if this was like fight 120, 160, I could uh, justify it a little bit more, but here comes Boss Classic Raiden. He is always going to do what he does. I think he takes me out. Nope, my Revenant kicks in, you guys. And I think I just try to get him out of here pretty soon. I, actually, I drop his SP2. That's what I do. I try to get that health going back as fast as I can. I, know, I realize I'm only down to like 25 seconds, but I want to tag him out and then drop in somebody else. So here comes Classic Ra uh, Classic uh, Ermac again, dropping his SP2, taking him up on the elevator from to the top floor and just slamming him down, you guys. Uh, could probably try to get up to his SP2 again. Nope, I don't. He gets taken out. But Strike Force saves him. And I think at this point, is I am realizing that it's just going to take two attempts. So I go ahead and throw his uh, X ray. It does a little bit of damage. And now I'm. <laughs> freaking phone's going off. But here I go. And with three seconds left, that is all the damage I'm going to do on the first attempt. Now, looking on Twitter, it does seem like a lot of people. A lot of people. <laughs> had to do this in more than one attempt. So don't feel bad if you did, because that's totally normal with this fight number 60, because it is, like I said, it's, it's a pretty tough fight. So going into round two, here we go. Uh, just have a, you know, about half the health for um, Raiden. So let's get into it right now. And here we go, everybody. Attempt number two, same old tactic, same old tactic. Gonna freeze boss classic Raiden. All right, and hit him with uh, SP1 now. Watch this. This is the wondrous glory of Freddy Krueger's SP2. Just watch his health just melt off of that dude right there. Um, of course, I don't learn because if I did learn, I would wait for Freddy to get closer and closer to uh, to the opponent before I start swinging with basics. But yeah, someday maybe I will. Um, I've only been playing this for six years, but apparently I can't remember. So here we go, SP2 one more time. And I think this is enough to take him out possibly. But yeah, that was a pretty crazy boss fight you guys for 60 
trying to think if it was the Cold War Tower or the Sorcerer's Tower. One of those two. One of those two, um, Fight 60 was pretty hard as well, but that is it. That's it for me. I would love to know how you guys all did, and I will see you on 80. And with that, everybody, thank you all for watching and subscribing. Hey, everyone. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this kind of content or anything MK Mobile related, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And also, check out the MK Mobile podcast available on iTunes as well as Spotify.